Later on, Natasha Myers, the Commonwealth champion from St Vincent and Grenadines, doesn't start. That's a shame. So Diane Borg on the inside for Malta. Eft him over, or well, she will have seen her compatriot Lalova go through and in fine style. Anna Claudia Silva, the South American record holder. Pretty decent personal best, 11 1 5. Moldova of Kazakhstan in five. Shelly Ann Fraser, Fraser Price will go out really hard in lane six. She always starts very well. Detonano of Nauru, 12.54. She might struggle to keep up with the uh, world champion in seven. But watch out for Blessing Okabare. Superb talent, long jump bronze medalist in the Olympics three years ago. Shelly Ann Fraser Price. It's almost a little embarrassed wave to the crowd there. She knows the Jamaican fans are here in force. That is Shelly Ann Fraser Price. Don't worry, blessing Okabare. There she is, goes in lane number eight. Long jump bronze. You can see there she's run 11 flat, 11.08 this season, and she will have seen Osayomi, her compatriot, go through and in some style in the third heat. They're always so big and powerful, the Nigerians. So, Borg F. Timova, Silva, Bulldover, Fraser Price, Detonamo, and Okabare. Shelly Ann Fraser Price, the defending champion, the world champion, the Olympic champion, looking for a trademark fast start here. Looks very relaxed, really fancy spikes as well. A bit like footballers, you've got to be good if you uh, ply your trade in an unusual <laughs> colour of footwear. And uh, I guess if you're the Olympic champion and world champion, you can get away with that. Fraser Price in six. Okabari of Nigeria in eight. Look for the Jamaican woman to start really quickly. Set. Fifth heat here. <laughs> Shelly Ann Fraser Price is indeed up into her running very quickly. Okabari is going well also on the near side. And a quarter silver going through and the Bulgarian coming through on the near side. So Shelly Ann Fraser Price easing down on the line. Blessing Okabari was really, really coasting in second place. Well, that was very, very comfortable indeed. She did exactly what we'd expected her to do. She went out hard for 40 or 50 metres. She was aware that Okabare was there, and then she took her foot off the gas and looked very, very impressive indeed. But also, I thought Okabare looked pretty good there. She also managed to ease up quite a long way before the line. She's taken it 11-1-0. And Claudia Silva of Brazil has been given the third spot. That was a really good run by her. She had a great second half of the race, but... Okabare and Fraser Price, both Kath, looking pretty impressive there. Well, they were kind of the opposites of races, weren't they? Shelly Ann Fraser Price out like a rocket. Okabare out like a very slow train, but then came at the end like a rocket. Shelly Ann Fraser Price, though, my gosh, look at that. Talk about slowing down at about 50 metres to go. It was a, a wonderful example of sprinting. Blessing Okabare, she is tall. She's already competed here in Daegu, of course. She was eliminated out of the long jump qualifying, which is a bit of a surprise when you consider she's the Olympic bronze medalist in that event. But one of them is about five foot ten, and Shelly Ann Pre Fraser Price, for my money, is about five foot flat. Absolutely, <laughs> she is I was going to say, five Kat, foot one. <laughs> just such a contrast in, in physiques between the two of them. You almost wonder where someone as diminutive as, as Fraser Price gets that power to have such a fast start. It's such a contrast to the, the big, powerful Nigerian. Nice to see an embrace there between the Jamaican and the Nigerian. It's easy to be happy when you're winning <laughs> and when you're going through. So, confirmation then. Blessing Okabare, really impressive going through. Shelly Ann Fraser Price did exactly what she needed to do, and a good run by Anna Claudia Silva going through as the third automatic qualifier, 11 27.